What is up guys, welcome to the top 5 fidget spinners you won't believe actually exist. What's going on everyone, welcome back to a brand new video. So in this one, we're going to be doing another fidget spinner video because you guys seem to really enjoy that video. It got really popular really fast. I'm pretty sure you guys really enjoyed it as well by the comments. You can probably see them on the screen now. This one's going to be a little bit different though because I've seen all around YouTube, people have made their own fidget spinners. Now these inventions are really, really cool. Some of these are absolutely huge versions of them. Some of them are really cool, very dangerous as well. So you guys will really enjoy this video. This one is a lot of fun. This one was a lot of fun to research and make as well. So if you do enjoy, leave a like, subscribe to it to the giveaway, which will be done at a million subscribers. And a lot of you guys say the uh, giveaway is not legit. I did a giveaway before, and a lot of you guys thought I didn't give away the actual prizes, which I actually did. And uh, yeah, the proof's on my Twitter from ages ago, but I just want to clarify that now. Anyway, let's get into the video. So a thousand likes, I'll do another one of these videos. Let's get right into it i hope you enjoy and yes yeah, some of these uh, fidget spinners are literally insane so you definitely want to stay to the end i've also done a video on this yesterday so you can check that out at the end of this video anyway let's get into it so this first video is actually quite insane and quite weird as well. So this first guy actually attaches a fidget spinner to his car. Now this guy's actually a YouTuber and he's done a lot of fidget spinner videos in the past and he thought he'd uh, spice things up a little bit with his video and he attaches a mega one to his car to make it go really fast. And this was a little extension that he added. And yeah, a lot of people seem to really enjoy this video. So I thought this one was really cool because it's one that makes your car look... Uh, a little bit cringy, I'm not going to lie. It will make your car look a little bit cringy if you had one of these. But I guess it's a little cool extension for a video idea. And uh, yeah, let me know as well, guys. A lot of you guys will comment in the comment section that a lot of your fidget spinners are banned in schools. Some of you are allowed them and some of you aren't. And apparently they're going like wildfire in school, like everyone has one. So let me know in the comment section if you have one. Anyway, yeah, so this guy attaches it to his uh, car, obviously. And when the wheels go, the fidget spinner also turns as well. And it goes at an insane speed so uh, yeah I'm not sure the, the fastest fidget spinner to actually record it's probably about a thousand kilometers per hour or something but yeah let me know let's add some orange paint oh yeah that looks so good orange is done let's wait for it to dry and then we'll add some blue might as well see where Liz is at on the cookie status oh yeah look guys they are coming out good Liz that looks awesome for the cloth flip the giant fidget spinner over and we are going to glue it in the center just like that so let's get the hot glue gun add a little bit of hot glue to each of the sides press and hold and wait for the glue to dry now grab your bolt and poke it through the cardboard so it pops out the other side now secure the hold and wait for the glue to dry I've been waiting for a while you think it's dry Carter I think it's dry let's see oh, oh okay so top Oh yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Oh, that looks so good. Fidget spinner on a truck. Woo! High speed drive by, here he comes. Oh my gosh, it's totally wobbly. Oh, but it looks so cool. So this next one might not be as big as the one attached to the truck or as cool, but I thought I'd put this one in because it just looks really, really, really cool, this design. This guy actually makes his own fidget spinner, and a lot of people have actually made their own. I've seen some guy actually make a really cool-looking one, and a lot of people are saying in the comments that he should sell his own because it looked way better than some of the originals even. And yeah, some of these are ridiculously cool. So this guy's one just looks really unique. I've never seen one like it. And uh, yeah, I thought I'd put it, well, this one in because it just looked really cool to me. It's a little bit of a unique design. You wouldn't really know it as a fidget spinner from first glances. But uh, yeah, it looks a lot better than the original ones that you get. And uh, yeah, the original idea for these is just to kind of stop you from fidgeting. But they're not really used for that anymore. They're more used just to kind of like distract you from your everyday life and all it does is just make you distracted from work and stuff at school so if you have one at school let me know if you actually get on with your work or just use this because if it was me I'd just be on this all the time and it would distract the hell out of me curve, just glinting right at the front there I did that there and that there right now so that's got a curve this side's got a oh look at that 
Let's get a close up on that. This next one is definitely for you food lovers out there. Now this next one was really cool in my opinion and the video starts up and you see straight away one of the fidget spinners which has been attached to a lot of sweets. Now I'm not sure if this was just a tiny little extension or this guy went into a lot of effort to attach these. You'll probably see it in the video. Uh, I just saw it straight away and downloaded it and I thought I'd put it in this video. So yeah, this was really cool to me because I don't know, there's something about it that's really cool. Like there's just a sweet part as well but something extra as well. I just thought that this was really, really unique and a really good idea. But the only thing is, you'd probably eat it after about five minutes because of how much, it, how good it looks. Because you keep looking at these things while you spin it. And if you're looking at sweets for a long time, you're obviously going to eat it after a while. So it probably doesn't work very well, especially if you're one to eat a lot of sweets in your time. Anyway, yeah, I just really, really enjoyed this one. So, yeah, let me know what you think in the comment section down below what your favourite is. This is probably my favourite. And, yeah, here's a little clip of that now. I don't be stressing these souls. No, it's just chips. They're gonna break. The peanut butter cup, jelly jam, whatever it was. Nope, it's not gonna work. All right, so I got the stuff right here. So without wasting time, let's construct these candy gummy fidget spinners. All right, guys, to make these, first you wanna grab some bearings. I got these bearings off my skateboard. And you're gonna want your hot glue gun ready, plugged in. So I got the hot glue gun with a hot glue stick. Move that aside. All right, so first, I'm gonna do the main art version. So we're gonna just need one bearing for this. So you see how a fidget spinner looks like. There's three weights there, so there'll be more momentum to spin faster. So basically, we're just gonna grab main arts. Let's grab a couple. Let's see like one of each color, so it's colorful. All right, so move this side. That's basically all the main arts we need for this. And you just go on to hot glue them. Hopefully the main arts don't melt. Hot glue. Let it dry. Also, you don't want any hot glue inside the bearing or it won't spin. Okay, I'm just gonna do this, so time lapse now. That looks so sick. Whoa. Whoa. This is the fidget spinner. Now let's move on to our next one. So grab another bearing. We're gonna go for the Cadbury's right here. Just grab colorful Cadbury's. Same thing. I'm gonna hot glue it, so time lapse. Skydles fidget spinner right here. That's so trippy. All right, guys. So if you enjoyed this video, that wrap. Now, if you guys are ninjas or want to be a ninja, I saw that Nigahiga video, How to Be a Ninja, and kind of wanting to be a ninja yourself. You probably have all the equipment. You have all like the blacked out like equipment and everything. You probably have like nunchucks and all that, and a shuriken. Well, this is a very cool design for a fidget spinner. If you're a ninja and you also uh, suffer with like, ADHD or you fidget a lot, this is perfect for you. So this guy made a shuriken, which is like one of those foreign stars, and he makes it into a fidget spinner, which is very cool. It's probably very dangerous as well, so I wouldn't try this at home unless you're trained. Uh, but yeah, this just looks really, really cool in my opinion. And this is definitely one of my favorites on this list. It honestly looks amazing. So props to this guy for making it. And yeah, honestly, if these actually had their own brand and he actually sold it, I would probably buy it 100% because it looks so cool, honestly. One of the coolest designs I've seen. Anyway, yeah, just one of my favorites in general. So the title of this next video is Massive Fidget Spinner Toy. 
this fidget spinner is probably the biggest one you've seen. Honestly, it's absolutely huge, and you can't spin it with your hands, obviously. You need some sort of machinery to actually spin this, and God forbid you accidentally got in the way of this thing, because it would literally hurl you miles. Honestly, this could probably be used for something useful, to like create electricity or whatnot, because if you didn't know, you can make energy, and then the ele energy goes into electricity. You could probably function this somehow into your own house, to kind of save energy but anyway I'll kind of on a little bit of a tangent here this is just a very very cool version and it's amazing what people could do with objects in such a short amount of time these things have only been around for a couple of months and these guys have already pimped out the fidget spinner and made some awesome awesome inventions so props to this guy for making it it looks amazing and the table is very simple let's try with my hand It's important not to move out of the plane because it will start shaking. So thank you all so much for watching this video, don't forget to subscribe to enter the giveaway, like the video, 1000 likes and I'll do another video like this, you guys smashed it yesterday, so let me know in the comment section if you want more, and I'll see you guys in the next video, thanks for watching, and goodbye.